Scholar and the Gentleman is a, uh, has really two meanings. Uh, you can be a scholar without being a gentleman, and you can be a gentleman without being a scholar. Very seldom do you find them in the same person. Uh, I've been fortunate to know many people that are both scholars and gentlemen. My name is John Joseph Balistrieri, the son of Frank Balistrieri. Life Sentence is a story I wrote about my life experience growing up in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, being the son of Frank Balistrieri. And, and it's a story about a, a, a bifurcated existence, an existence with one foot in two cultures. It is unusual for me, looking back, about all the things I experienced, which I didn't think odd at the time, but in fact were peculiar. Back in the early 70s, my father was instrumental in securing a $62,750,000 loan from the Teamsters Union to acquire the Stardust and the Fremont Hotel and Casinos. There was another $25 million borrowed from the Teamsters from improvements. So the total value of Teamster loans came up to be about $125 million. Subsequently, the government indicted people from Milwaukee, Chicago, Kansas City, Cleveland, and Las Vegas into a conspiracy charge, to use their term, skim $2 million from the operation of the Stardust in Fremont. That was known as the Arjun trial. It took me almost 14 months to prepare for that case. And my brother did an outstanding job as a trial lawyer. And when he was done with the government's case, they knew they were going nowhere. And they were frightened. So they wanted us out of the courtroom. I actually got some good points here. <laughs> <laughs> 